The Diploma is a new qualification designed jointly by the education and business communities to equip young people with the knowledge, skills and experience they need to succeed in tomorrow's workplace through a shared approach to teaching and learning. This focus on strong education business links has created new challenges for teaching practitioners, employers and students. 35 students based at County High School Leftwich, Rudheath Community High School and Mid Cheshire College chose to study the new diploma in creative and media. As this was a new experience for many of the employers, they were provided with a support toolkit designed to help them in their work with the students. I worked with Eddie from Aquarius Metal Craftworks. I was a bit nervous to start with and I was talking with my mates about it and they think, oh, it'll be fine, it'll be good. The Diploma Net project was designed to integrate the workplace and the classroom. Um, I thought it was a really good idea actually because sort of on the earlier projects of in doing the diploma, we, we didn't really meet any employers or anyone sort of in the industry. 20 creative industry employers signed a pledge to confirm their support for the project. They defined real life business project briefs to be completed by the students. Through an activity based on speed dating, the students met the employers and used their communication skills to learn about each business and the project briefs. <laughs> it was quite interesting, it was a good day actually, you sort of kept you on your toes. You could say it was speed dating. We all, they all lined up, huh? sat down, ready to talk to us, and in groups we all spoke to them, interviewed them. I was really pleased with it. Um, my favourite piece was actually my pitch. It was like a big two, um, two booklet and it was, I just loved it. It was like all based on pop art. In my point of view, I think the record project was the best project we did for the um, diploma so far. So I was really into it. I really liked and um, doing all the technical stuff on the computers. I worked with um, Steve at a place called Wazoo, which is a toy shop. The term employers does not just refer to larger companies, but also to small businesses, sole traders and freelancers. My idea came from both my employer and my teacher, and I ended up creating a 3D puzzle for adults. I think it's just the new experience what makes you want to carry on doing all your work because you don't often get to work with an employer in any of your normal school work but doing the diploma it's been a great new experience. The pupils have learned a great deal of communication skills through this project. They've learned how to talk to an employer face to face which is obviously an adult which they aren't always used to communicating with in a, in a very formal situation. This unique approach brings learning to life for the students by giving them a valuable insight into the world of work and allows teaching staff to develop strong partnerships with the business community. As the projects began to take shape, support and guidance was given by the employers through email, visits to school or college and in the workplace. It's a fantastic, very exciting course, really based around pupils um, thinking and learning for themselves, taking their own experiences forward. These tasks had to fit within the principal learning of the diploma. The student's work had to be assessed in relation to set criteria as defined by the diploma curriculum. It took time and effort to develop a plan that would achieve this. And we got to do more in this project. Like in other projects, you won't get to make a necklace. Having considered all the briefs and with the help of their teachers, the students chose one or two to pitch for. The employers then commissioned the work and gave feedback to the students they would be supporting. It's been great to work with employers. Um, I worked with Gillian at the Potter's Wheel. I produced two plaques and um, first of all I designed them and I took them to Gillian and she thought they were a really good idea and she gave me some advice. When the students came here they were very excited about asking questions about where the clay comes from, where it, you know, where the materials are from. Um, how do we come up with the designs, where do the ideas come from. They learnt a heck of a lot about the whole making process of clay, especially how long it actually took. Um, and also things like costing for a pot, um, how much is actually materials, but how much is actually your time going into doing something creative. Businesses can benefit in a number of ways. Building relationships with a local school, helping to shape the workforce of tomorrow and allowing staff to develop a range of skills by working directly with young people. The Diploma Net project has been so invaluable, not just for the learners, but also for the businesses, because it provides them with a ready-made pool of talent. So the background information that they get from this, from this environment and this, this project that you're running 
is invaluable for them. Yeah, I just felt that it was a good opportunity to get some idea of how it would be like working in the actual industry. It taught me really how to manage my time. Good opportunities for kids to actually realise what is happening or what is expected of them outside that classroom. I thought there was an exciting opportunity to get some insight into the field of which I may go into in the future. I learnt how the industry works, it's stressful. It's given the young people a real insight into the way employees operate, how they engage with industries, etc. Bringing together the two different worlds of business and education is no easy task, but this has been achieved by the partnership between Education Business Plus, part of Connections Cheshire and Warrington, and CRISP, the Creative Industries Support Project, and as a result of the support and commitment given by the employers, schools and college. Funding has been provided by the National Endowment for Science, Technology and the Arts. DiplomaNet has its rightful place within diploma delivery, and not just for creative and media. If you would like to know more about the potential applications of this model of work-related learning, please contact Education Business Plus 01606 555700 or on the web www.ebplus.org.uk